In the quiet outskirts of Willow Creek, there stood a well, weathered by time and forgotten by most. Legend had it that beneath its moss-covered stones lay a tragic tale, whispered only in hushed tones by those brave enough to speak of it. It was said that many years ago, a young girl named Emily met her untimely demise at the hands of a merciless stranger, her innocence forever tainted by the darkness of the world. As the years passed, the memory of Emily faded into obscurity, but her restless spirit lingered on, trapped within the depths of the well where her life was cruelly snuffed out. And so, the well became a place of dread, avoided by the townsfolk who sensed the lingering presence of something malevolent. But despite the warnings and the eerie tales spun around the well, there were always those who dared to venture too close, drawn by morbid curiosity or foolish bravado. And it was on one such moonlit night that three unsuspecting teenagers, emboldened by liquid courage and youthful naivety, decided to test the limits of their fear. The night air hung heavy with the promise of danger as they approached the well, their laughter masking the unease that gnawed at the edges of their consciousness. With trembling hands, they lowered a rusty bucket into the darkness below, the sound of its descent echoing eerily in the stillness of the night. And then, as if summoned by their intrusion, a soft whimpering filled the air, sending shivers down their spines. At first, they dismissed it as a trick of the wind, but as the sound grew louder, they could no longer deny its haunting familiarity. It was the sound of a child crying. Their hearts pounding in their chests, the teenagers exchanged nervous glances, their bravado evaporating like mist in the morning sun. But before they could flee, a figure emerged from the shadows, her pale face streaked with tears and her eyes burning with a vengeful fury. It was Emily. With a blood-curdling scream, she lunged at them, her spectral form passing through their flesh as if it were air. And in that moment of terror, they understood the true horror of the well, its depths concealing not just the tragic tale of a lost soul, but the insatiable hunger of a vengeful spirit. From that day forth, the well remained untouched, a silent sentinel guarding the secrets of the past. But the memory of Emily's torment lingered on, a warning to all who dared to disturb the peace of Willow Creek, lest they too fall victim to the haunting of Willow Well.